excellent defense. We all know for Seattle. And speaking of their defense, wow, the MVP of the game. Could have gone around a bunch of ways. Malcolm Smith comes up for the big plays this postseason. This is from the NFC Championship game. Colin Kaepernick's pass intended for Michael Crabtree. Catch by Richard Sherman. But it's Smith who gets the pick. Well. 22 seconds left. And then in the Super Bowl, Pink Manning's pass. Tip this time of the line. And Smith Just got done watching the Super Bowl. That gives Seattle at that point a 22 to nothing lead. It so was asked, a very interesting is, game. Congratulations to the Seattle Seahawks on winning their first Super Bowl. No, I am not a Seattle fan by far. I would never jump ship. I am a Philadelphia Eagle for life. Let's be clear. Richard, put this into perspective what you guys just did, especially on defense against a quarterback. But um, I'm making this video because earlier in the night, I was strolling through my YouTube feed. And I happened to come upon one of my favorite YouTubers. And he made this video already crowning the Denver Broncos Super Bowl champions. And he went on to even call my name out. I think it was something like, DJ, where's your team at? I, I, I found this funny. I laughed. <laughs> it's like, wow, that's that's very that's very very cocky, very ballsy. You already crowning yourself Super Bowl champ when the game hasn't even been played yet. You know? So I made my comment. So what I said. And I'm quite sure my buddy was on the other end going, yeah, say what you want to say, but we're going to get this championship real quick. And then the game came on. I have never in my life seen a lopsided Super Bowl like this. Denver got beat so bad that their mascot, I think the horse died. Hey, this was neutral site, man, and their defense took this thing over. Uh, they really do, and they play a variety yeah. of um, really vanilla, like people say. 43 to 8. Complex. They play man, um, they play bump, they play bail. No, uh, they the Denver did not win. Uh, about Pete and his style. Let me say this real quick. Again, yes, I'm a Philadelphia Eagles fan. No, we have not, never won a Super Bowl. I can sit here and say that to you guys right now. But I don't live in the past. I live in the now. Denver didn't win last year. They didn't win the year before last. They definitely didn't win tonight. So anybody can say what they want about my, my squad, about, you know, Philadelphia not being, having rings, whatever, we're not, which is true. I've, I've come to terms with that. But again, the secondary linebacker are tied to the front. We talk about right now. Everything works together. And, and to Chris's point, they do play because all this particular YouTuber, he had two favorite teams, Steelers, Broncos. We all know what happened to the Steelers. And we just see what happened to the Broncos. So in my eyes, all this work was for nothing. 
Seahawks we didn't win, season. nor did you. You must feel like stewed shit. Do. I say all this to say this. Don't count your eggs before they hatch. You feel me? If I was you, I'd go ahead and um, delete that video. <laughs> Just take it down. Because you look real foolish right about now. And if you're wondering who am I talking about, I'm talking about my man, ATH the Great, the Great 522. Athens, Dante. This one's for you, homeboy. Hey, but we can't say this. I know your brother, Shaquille, is happy because they did play in his stadium. So he had the satisfaction of knowing that your man got beat in his stadium. Oh man, this is a great night. This is a great night, it is. Athens, my boy, man. I love you, man. I'll holler at you later. Call me.